Now, welcome in the man, Woj, Bombs. is here. Um, one of the other parts of the Brett Brown story has to be the unique situation that is rookie Markel Fultz. Right. What did he tell you about the approach for that? As big of a challenge as he's faced as a head coach handling this Markel Fultz situation this year, and that's as, he, as we talked about the Joel Embiid injury, Ben Simmons injury, uh, New Orleans Noel missed the season. <clears throat> uh, the, the psychological and the physical um, issues that went into this whole season with him. And now you've got him in a situation in a Boston series against the player he was traded for, Jason Tatum, who is as, you know, is clearly going to be a star in this league. And remember, that wasn't a one-on-one -on -one trade. Boston also has Philly's first-round pick uh, this coming year because of that deal. You know, there's a lot to unpack there for faults, and, and this has been as delicate of a thing as, as Brett Brown has had to deal with. We want to talk some coaching? We've got to talk some coaching. All the vacancies <laughs> that are around. Yesterday, you reported the big news that Becky Hammond will be the first woman to interview for a head coaching spot. It's my girl. In Milwaukee. Uh, what's the latest? Yeah, she'll interview late next week in Milwaukee. And listen, she's a fourth assistant in San Antonio. This, for her, is a great opportunity to start getting in front of uh, management, ownership with teams. Uh, she's not one of the front runners. Uh, for the job, but but this is for her a great first step. Uh, I'm told Mike Budenholzer, the former Atlanta coach now, is set to interview in Milwaukee next week, and David Blatt, the former Cleveland coach, will do a Skype interview later in the week. Uh, so Steve Clifford, Monty Williams, uh, James Borrego, or some of the other coaches they're going to meet with next week in Milwaukee. That's a, that's a lot of candidates. Uh, all Spurs. I know, the pop, the pop tree <laughs> it's is obvious. big. They're not getting an interview for the job? I I'm not. not. I never was a spur. Can't Bucks. be perfect. I thought for the Bucks job. I like all of those guys. Monty Williams. Yes, indeed. To me, if I'm them, I'm hiring Monty Williams. To well, there are the other, degree. I mean, there are other openings and other spots. What else is out there? Yeah, in Charlotte, uh, two candidates uh, will get second interviews this weekend. Uh, Jay Laranega, an assistant in Boston, and James Borrego at San Antonio will go down and have second interviews uh, with the Hornets this weekend. So everyone that works for the Spurs is getting interviewed somewhere? <laughs> Almost. Okay, so I'll make sure we have that out there. Woj, thank you as always Thanks, for guys. being here.